wait. Listen, I gotta get to the office and sort this out. Guys, I know it's been a long day, but could you give me a quick hand? Sure, our specialty. Tell me you're getting hung up on Harry. You're coming down off a hot show. You need to get laid. She's right, honey. Then I go and choose one. $686.47 worth of sexual bliss. Yeah, but you never hit on us or anything sleazy like that. This is kind of sudden. You've only had three years to get ready. Come on, ladies, get naked. Let's go. Together. Not because of that super bimbo. And this time tomorrow, she's going to be working for me. Right, Danny boy? Isn't the sex goddess of the Western world? Nice to meet you, my dear. Isn't this better than anything Harry Horner can do for you? I wouldn't know. Harry and I would never inspect. Ugh, then he's a bigger fool than I ever thought. Why do you say such things? Because you're never going back. But I'm free to go back to Harry if I choose. Am I not? Well, of course. But why would you want to go anywhere else? Here you have the best of everything. <laughs> Arthur, I want you here. You are to please Miss Veronica in any way that she chooses. And you are only to speak when spoken to. Nothing's happening. Why is nothing happening? Just relax and let me do the work, okay? Do That's my girl. Twenty of them? Okay. The Fisticat Clubs have just ordered five thousand dollars worth of pen laws, and so have the Women's Republican Club of Iowa. Hey, hey, hey! I think you've created a monster, Harry. But you'll always be my favorite.